All right, hey, Shalom, Makyam. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahweh Ba'ashim Rakak Wadash, double honors to your apostles and elders of Great Millstone. We are the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, Simul Indians, West Indians, and Haitians. And according to the Holy Scriptures, we're God chosen people. Shalom to all the brothers out there pushing this knowledge and sincerity and truth. Shalom to the few sisters. Shalom to the Israelites who are scattered among the other nations um, and, then, and that are scattered throughout the four corners of the earth. Shalom to you all. What you're looking at is a true depiction of the one eagerly called Jesus Christ, whose real name in the Hebrew is Jehovah Shai, and the Heavenly Father named Jehovah, the one eagerly called God of Jehovah, and they are so called black men. All right, uh, this is totally in the spirit. There's some impromptu. Um, it's going to be based upon these mass shootings, man. All right. So over this weekend, you know, it's, it's been at least what it says 31 killed in U.S. weekend mass shootings. All right. Trump condemns racism, bigotry, white supremacy after weekend of mass shootings, which is bull crap. All right. Pretty much. Um. What else they got out here, man? What else they have, man? All these mass shootings that's going on in the United States, man. The Lord is allowing these things to happen because this place is about to collapse. All right? This place is about to collapse, man. And more of these things are going to happen. And help me follow you how about Shimei Awashai got this thing totally set up for this place, uh, America, to be destroyed. It's going to be great insurrections out here. All right. The civil war. More shootings. And this just uh, these scenarios just remind me of this movie that came back that came out in 2009 called Rampage. Where is it at? If you could you could check this out, this movie out Rampage. I must show some um, some parts from it. Somebody actually downloaded this, uh, one of the favorite parts in the movies of the, uh, the street shooting. I don't want to give it away, man, because be, um, you got to watch it for yourself. But these are the same scenarios that are taking place in the United States of America today. Check it out. We're going to witness things like this, man. All right, pretty much this guy, man, I don't want to give the movie away. You got to watch it. He pretty much controlled that van to go into the, into the police precinct and blew that joint up. But it gets better. Here's a, here's a part, the part right, real quick. You notice in these shootings, man, they, they, uh, one of the um, shootings that happened, they said the guy had um, body armor on and things of that nature, man. So these things are all stage.
Yeah. That's what's coming, man. Hey, Kahala, Yahabah, Shimia, Washai, man. These are the things that are written in the scriptures. And it's only going to escalate, man. You know what I'm saying? These things are written in the scriptures to let you know you and the man, America, this world is in for a rude awakening, man. A rude awakening, man. Sarat 39 and 28, it says, There be spirits that are created for vengeance, which in a fu fury lay on sore strokes. So these, these, these are, um, you know, probably mind control, um, I, I, um, I, operators, I mean, uh, operatives, Salaki so operatives, ultimately is controlled by Yahweh Bashim Shai, man. You understand? The walk up in that Walmart out there in, um, was it El Paso? And kill those people off. Um, people are out there in Ohio, dating Ohio at night, you know, having, you know, some drinks and they got killed off, man. These are the times we're living in, some very serious times. So there will be spirits that are created for vengeance, which in their fury lay on sore strokes. In the time of destruction, they pour out their force and appease the wrath of him that made them. That's Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. All right? <laughs> So yeah, man, that's the time frame we in. More mass shootings, more things like like that is going is going to take place, man. It's going to escalate into um, what you call um, martial law. All right, martial law about to take place in this place, man. Second, just chapter eight, verse fifty. For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world, because they have walked in great pride, and that's that's dealing with you Americans, man. You know, the Lord, it, it's not like it's really racially profiled. You know, you got some Israelites that got killed in El Paso. It's correct, but this is white on white crime. And this thing is going to escalate, man. It's going to escalate your, your regular malls. It's not going to be safe to come outside anymore, right? Real real soon, man, because you're going to be under martial law. It's not going to be safe, man. These, these uh, major cities, ma major uh, freeways going to be, gonna be um, blocked off real soon, man. Because the, cause the so-called white man is going to come down because he know he has a short time. But it all plays in the hands of the Heavenly Father, man. All right? And I'm going to jump down. It says, uh, Oh, they have created. Where is it at, man? All right. It says, verse 56. For when they had taken liberty... They despise the Most High, thought scorn of His law, and forsook His ways, and that's what's going on out here with two thirds of our people and the whole entire planet. Don't know. I mean, they, they're learning now. They're gonna find out about Yahweh Bashim Shai, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, because the whole world is out of place right now, man. It has been given to the hands of the wicked. Moreover, they have trodden down His righteous. And I said in their heart that there is no God. A lot of people out here don't believe there's a high power. They're atheists. Yea, and that knowing they must die. See that? All right. For as the things aforesaid shall receive you, so thirst and pain are prepared for them. For it was not his will that the men should, should come to naught. All right. But they which which be created have defiled the name of him that made them and were thankful unto him which prepared life um, for them. So after this uh, civil unrest, you know, martial law, Mosai says uh, thirst and pain is, is created for you people out here, man. So more to come. Just like the movie Rampage, man, more to come. All right, more to come, man. And, and, and hey, man, Ka halal, yahal, bashim, yahal, shai, man. People might think we're crazy, but these are the things. If you open your Bible and read, you'll see what we're talking about, man. All right. I'm on Second Ezra 16. Um, I'm gonna go to uh, verse uh, chapter 15. So this is all uh, you know in the spirit, seeing what's going on, and you know, spirit hopped on me. To do this uh, quick show, it says, uh, 2 Ezra 15 and 1, Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the words of prophecy which I which I will put in thy mouth, said the Lord. And that's what we're doing 
Every time we go out, we're dealing with the Bible, man. People don't read your Bible. You, you go to these Catholic church and these uh, these churches and you're being lied to. So when things like this happen, you're bugging out. The, oh, my God, my cousins died and uh, we need to do something by gun control. That's what they want you to do. They want you to, to react that way so they take away your rights, man. Take away your rights so you be unharmed for them to bring the... Uh, Bring that, that death and destruction on you, man. And cause them to be written in paper for they are faithful and true. And everything we've been prophesying is, is happening and is, and, is, and is about to happen. Fear not the imagination against thee. Let not the incredulity of them trouble thee that speak against thee. So it's dealing with you unbelievers. You mockers and you scorners, man. You know, for all the unfaithful shall die in their unfaithfulness. Behold, said the Lord, I will bring plagues upon the world, the sword. You know what I'm saying? You just over this weekend, a mass uh, shooting, man, a lot of death. The sword is the modern day gun. And after that, it's going to lead to famine, death, and destruction. All right? For wickedness had exceedingly polluted the whole earth, and their hurtful works are fulfilled. And that's what, hey, man. Is, all right? That's what's going on, man. At least 31 killed in U.S. weekend mass shootings. All right. And there was another article I was looking at about how many uh, mass shootings that happened uh, in the United States this year. Um, the list of mass shootings in the United States. Here it is. Here it is, man. 2019. And look what, you know, this thing is just escalating, man, because they're about to lock America down, man. All right, I'm trying to get to the uh, the list. The list right here. All right, in Memphis, August fourth. Oh, they just haven't one today. Holy shit! One man was killed and three others were injured in the early morning shootings. See that? August fourth, Brooklyn. Nobody's dead. Four injured. Crown Heights, Chicago. You know, and the list go on and on, man. And the, the major one is El, El Paso. All right. 22 dead. 24 injured. All right. And the list go on and on, man. You know, not to mention these cops killing these people out here as well. So, like the Bible said, man. All right, for the hurtful works are fulfilled. A wickedness has exceedingly polluted the oral hurt. So the Lord's about to um, bring more plagues and destruction unto this wicked ass kingdom, man. So, you know, it's a quick impromptu. It reminds me of the movie Rampage. It's three parts. You know what I'm saying, too? But you could check it out. I believe some of them is on Netflix. So we're giving all praise to y'all by Shimmy. I was shy. Hopefully, you don't cut my video from that mu music um, movie clip. Brock the Yahweh, Brock the Yahweh Shai, Brock the Yahweh, Brock the Yahweh Shai, Shalom.